Vietnam and the Army Futures Command are teaming up to improve combat casualty care in the United States. CBS Austin's Emily Chavez tells us how this collaboration will improve trauma care and save lives on and off the battlefield. With the swipe of a pen, the University of Texas system and the Futures Army Command, also known as AFC, are officially working hand in hand to enhance trauma care. Both the Army and the UT system have unique skill sets and tools that are really are complementary. Uh, they, again, need to modernize how we care for soldiers that are wounded, and we need to modernize how we take care of civilian uh, casualties, whether the motor vehicle accidents or gunshot wounds. Dr. David Lakey is the chief medical officer for UT System. We can bring our research skills across our University of Texas institutions, the engineering skills, the ability to take care of large number of patients, and figure out how do we really modernize the tools we have to care for critically injured individuals. Um, what we're going to talk about today is a moonshot. This is an idea based on uh, solid and robust basic science research that we believe has the potential dramatic to dramatically change how we take care of people with um, hemorrhage and uh, especially battlefield injuries. Over the past year, UT System and AFC have been generating ideas on how to advance trauma care. The formal agreement signed Tuesday turned the ideas into a reality. One of the nice things it does is it sets a framework to make it easier for for military uh, labs like the Institute of Surgical Research and the University of Texas system to more, uh, to more effectively share resources of uh, both, both directions. Commander Stackle says this research and technology will save lives. And so our proposal, and we've been working together with Andre Kapp's team over the last year on this, is taking those PhD inhibitors to achieve normoxic hip stabilization, adaptive responses during hemorrhage, shock, anemia, and organ injury, and They've had great um, safety track record um, in these previous trials, and we think that they are a game-changing group of drugs when given early to injured soldiers to prevent hemorrhagic shock and to treat or prevent organ injury. What we hope to do with this partnership is help make sure that in that future, uh, future war that more people have an opportunity to come home to their loved ones than if we hadn't had a chance to do that research. Emily Chavez, CBS Austin News.